Hi, my name's Bob Lindy. I'm an herbalist and an herb grower. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to grow grass in a pot. And of course, that sounds like an odd statement to be growing something that you normally think of as in your lawn or maybe as an ornamental plant out in the front of your house. But actually, grass can be very attractive inside a decorative pot. And there's a variety of different types of grass that we can use. Anything from rye to wheat grass to things like pumpus grass that can grow quite large and even lemongrass. All of them can be quite attractive and easily grown inside of a pot. And just like any time you're trying to grow any plant inside of a pot, we want to get an appropriate sized pot for the type of plant you're growing, some really good, rich, well-drained soil, and of course go ahead and when we take that uh, potted grass out of, our, out of its container, we can go ahead and loosen the roots up a little bit, get it inside the dirt, and make sure we cover it and pack it in appropriately with some good, rich soil. Once it's in the pot, we can water it in, and grass really likes some sunlight. So we want to make sure that we find a location for this potted grass that's appropriate getting enough sunlight throughout the day. And honestly, when we grow things like wheat grass and some of the faster growing grasses that we're more familiar with, they can actually be very decorative. Oftentimes it looks like somebody's hair standing straight up on end. And you can do silly things like tie a ribbon into the grass. We can decorate the pot with a smiley face or even give it a haircut on a regular basis. And of course, just like lemongrass or wheatgrass, it could actually be something that we can eat or make tea out of and be quite enjoyable as well as nutritious. So this is Bob Lindy talking to you about how to grow grass in a pot. Please enjoy your herbs.